of being stabbed to death whenever I see a knife. It's not quite deja vu, but just seeing one of those things gives me a feeling like I'm being stabbed. I see. It's said that the shorter the physical distance between you and the enemy, the stronger your psychological resistance to violence becomes. It may be that the knife symbolizes close quarters combat, and it's evoking an image of your own death. So, my subconscious is warning me not to get gutted perhaps it's only a theory it wasn't real high on my to-do list anyway i know snake if you encounter an enemy with a knife watch out what could you do let's see you could avoid standing directly in front of them or roll to the side or step back to avoid a close quarters attack <laughs> i know it must sound funny for me to be giving you this kind of advice no it's good advice I think it's helping. Contact me anytime. There's something wrong. Yeah. Support you. Snake, you can't die. No, Snake. Snake. Rose, something's going on. I've been getting this weird feeling, like I died once already, and it was from a gunshot. Just seeing an enemy carrying a gun has been putting me on edge. Snake, your decades of experience might be trying to tell you something. Maybe it's a warning that the bullet that will finally kill you is coming when your back is turned. Tell me, what would you do if you saw a teammate engaging in risky behavior? Say, recklessly charging the enemy, or letting their mind wander in the middle of a firefight. I'd tell him not to get himself, or me, killed. Well, think of it this way. There's another you inside your subconscious that's telling you the same thing. Ah, uh, I see. Get back to the basics. Use the right stick to look for the enemy. Move cautiously and stay out of sight. I should start listening to my other me. Exactly. Take care of yourself out there, Snake. Snake? Are you all right? Snake? Snake! Rose. I know it sounds weird, but I can't shake this feeling that I've drowned before. Like deja vu? Well, more like I have this gut feeling, like I died underwater at some point. Are you afraid of water? I'm not afraid of anything. Then I wonder what it could be. Except now it feels like I'm more aware than ever of drowning. I'm paying more attention to my O2 gauge and coming up for air more regularly. That's a good thing, then. As long as you're aware of that danger and how to avoid it, you'll be able to respond more effectively to real-life crises. You're right. No more risky underwater maneuvers for me. Good to hear it, Snake. That's what we're all hoping for. That you'll finish the mission and come home safely. Hmm. That'd be nice. Anyway, sorry to bother you. Not at all. You can call me anytime, Snake. Come in, Snake! What happened? Snake? Snake! Rose, you there? There's something I wanted to ask you. You're not hurt, are you? Hurt? What are you talking about? Uh, nothing. Just making sure. Forget I asked. What's the matter? I was catching a few minutes of shut-eye, and I had a dream. A dream where you were in an explosion. It seemed so real, 
I couldn't help but get a little worried. Relax, I'm alive. Death by explosion, huh? It's true. One blast and I'm off to meet my maker. Not all explosives are the stationary bomb type. For example, if you hear a pin being pulled out of a grenade, you know what's coming next. You need to be aware of these things. Yeah, I'll make a point of it. Thanks for looking out for me, Rose. Don't mention it. Snake! You can't die! No! Snake! Snake! Rose, I feel kind of dumb bringing this up, but... It's okay, you can tell me. You see, I... I died recently. Died? Well, I can't shake the feeling that I've died before. I can't quite describe the sensation. It's like I died and then restarted the mission. I also get the sense that I'm watching myself from a distance, over my own shoulder. Hmm. It may be a mild case of depersonalization disorder. Meaning? It's nothing to be concerned about. It could be caused by some trauma you suffered in the past. In the past? What do you think it is? I can't say for sure, but this feeling that you've died before? Snake, maybe it's a warning about death in real life. What do you mean by warning? Your subconscious is constantly trying to get you to visualize death in your explicit conscious. So I should what? Act carefully? Avoid death? That's right. It's making sure you know that even you should fear death. After all, everybody's praying for you to come back safely. So please, Snake, be careful out there. Use your head before you act. I'll be more careful. Thanks.